All right, so here's just a quick video of this uh, speaker install I'm doing on my GTI. Um, got the door panel removed. All right, as you can see, I'm putting some JLC2s in there. Not the best, but uh, they'll do better than these, I think. Um, so to start, take your razor blade, cut this around here, all the way around. Once you got that surround cut out, just uh, just rip that thing out. Who needs it anyways? Uh, next, you're gonna see this uh, this basket here, all right? Um, for that, I'm gonna take my saws all to it, and uh, let's see if I can do this with one hand. Just basically, cut through all those like that. All right. So once you get all those cut out, you can just kind of rip this thing out because. We don't need that anymore either. I'll leave these little tabs in there though, just in case, because uh, I'll hook my speaker wires up there later. And uh, you can see quality sound I've been having with these speakers. Uh, your next step is to remove the tweeter housing. There's just a screw that goes into this little hole here, and then flip it over, take a flathead screwdriver. You can pry this off. You'll see the little stanchions there. All right. And then, uh, and then uh, just install the new one in there. It holds pretty good as long as you leave the three stanchions. If not, then whatever, but you know, kind of glue it in there. Be fine. Run your wires out the same way you did before. All right, so I just um, use the factory wires. I mean, the harness is pretty easy. The first two wires, the uh, these right here, are the inputs. Then uh, this would be your base driver would be the second set. And then, you know, the third set's going to be the um, mid-range and then you know your last set is obviously your uh, highs as you can see the purple and then the mid and then the low all right so then uh, to mount the speaker you just tap these guys right through it lines up pretty good and it sucks in you know where you don't really have any gaps so we'll see how it sounds